and when the global market is flooded by artificially cheap Chinese products, the viability of American and other foreign firms is put into question. And we've seen this story before. I've made clear that President Biden and I will not accept that reality again. So when we talk about the second China shock, uh, this is an effort to basically preempt another China shock in these other um, types of technologies and manufactured goods. Uh, President Biden has decided these are very important to the U.S. manufacturing base, uh, electric vehicle components, automotive components, things that are important to keep here in the United States. China is just uh, at the, about the beginning phase of ramping up these massive waves of exports of very cheap electric vehicles to Europe, to Africa, to Mexico, to South America. And there are worries that those could end up here. They will significantly undercut uh, the vehicles on the market here.